Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello everyone, let me introduce myself My name is Alia Audriana And I'm from BBC Chiratias On this occasion, I will deliver my speech About the challenges of home learning During the COVID-19 pandemic And before that, let me give thanks to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Who give us the healthy time And also change to continue learning until now Ladies and gentlemen For the last two years, the whole world has been hit by an outbreak disease named COVID-19. This virus, which is said to have originated in Wuhan, China, has become a scary thing because of its rapid spread and the risk of the death from the virus. People should not congregate or gather so that their space for movement is limited. This disturbs people's lives from various fields, especially in the economic and education sector. And let's we talk about education during this COVID-19. Because there is no crowd, therefore the school is suspended. All the students from elementary school to even college are doing learning from home. Of course, this is a challenge not only for students and teachers, but parents have to contribute to the learning process. Especially for the parents whose children are still in elementary school, who still really, really need parental guidance in carrying out these lessons. But this become difficult when we realize the fact that not all the parents of students are at home every day. Some of them might have to work and cannot accompany their children. But parents who can accompany their children also can get into trouble. This can be seen from various complaints from the mothers who accompany their children in this learning process. Some of them have difficulty in dividing their time between accompanying their children to study or taking care of household chores. Not only that, this home learning also requires technological assistance such as a cell phones or laptop that can support the implementation of this home learning. The problem is not everyone has the cell phones or a laptop and also the problem of internet quotas and network disturbances being problems that students must face at home. And also the ineffectiveness of delivering learning material is also felt by the students. And with the many challenges and problem in carrying out home learning, the government has provided several solutions such as the financial assistance or the distribution of internet quotas for learning. And we as a student must also try to fight against COVID-19 so that we can return to a normal learning at school. And this is the end of my speech today. I hope we can take a good lesson from what I deliver today and I ask for forgiveness for any words and behalf which are not supposed to do and thank you for your kind attention wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh